Good morning, friends. It feels like a million years since I've had the opportunity to share my devotions with you. It was a crazy busy summer, and we have a new friend here in the house, Mr. Pumpkin the Puppy, joining us. Um, So it's been a little bit crazy around here, but I wanted to jump on this morning and uh, share with you what I'm journaling in the Bible today. I'm actually in the Old Testament in Jeremiah 23, and God is asking the people some questions. He says, Am I a God at hand, declares the Lord, and not a God far away? Can a man hide himself in secret places so that I cannot see him, declares the Lord? Do I not fill heaven and earth, declares the Lord? And as I was reading this, it occurs to me that we uh, people have been trying to play hide and seek with God since the beginning of time. All the way back in Genesis, when we look at the very first people that God created, Adam and Eve, they sinned, they did something that they knew was wrong and was displeasing to God, and the first reaction that they had was to hide. Uh, They had had fellowship in the garden where they walked and talked with God every day, if you can imagine what that must have been like, and they just threw it all away. They hid from him thinking that he wouldn't find them, and You know, it's kind of laughable to think about how, you know, after all that time in God's presence, they really thought they could outsmart him. They really thought that they could hide and he wouldn't know where they were. I mean, this was the God who had created heaven and earth and who had created them from nothing. And they thought that they could be smarter than he was. Of course, God wasn't fooled by their hiding. He knew exactly where they were. Um, And it kind of makes me think of my own kids and myself when I was a kid. I remember one time getting so upset that I told my parents I was going to run away. And I actually ran into the bathroom and I hid beside the toilet. And uh, we had a very small house and a very small bathroom. And um, I, (laughs) I probably literally couldn't fit in that space anymore. But at the time, I thought I was so sneaky. I thought they'll never find me. And of course, my parents knew exactly where I was the whole time. I wasn't fooling anyone. And it's the same way with God. We think that we're getting away with something. We think that we can hide our sin from him. And the reality is he knows all along. He's known from the very beginning. He's just waiting for us to come to the realization that he sees all. He knows all. There's nothing in all of the universe that's hidden from him. We can try everything in our power, but we can't hide our thoughts, our actions. None of that can be kept hidden from God. He is omniscient. He knows all. He's all powerful. He's all seeing and he's everywhere. But the great news is that even though he knows everything, he is also willing to forgive us everything. The only problem is when we try to hide it and not repent. If we come to God and we say, hey, I did this, and you already know this, and I'm so sorry. God is gracious and merciful, and he forgives us all of our sins. He promises us that. It doesn't matter what we've done. He is able to cover it with the blood of Christ. But it's when we try to hide and pretend like we didn't do it and like he can't see it that we find ourselves in a heap of trouble. Hide and seek with God is a game we will never, ever win. So it's best to come to terms with the fact that All of our actions and all of our thoughts are known by our creator. And so we need to be upfront and honest with him. We need to seek repentance. Uh, We need to seek forgiveness when we mess up. And God is gracious and he meets us right where we are. That's the beautiful news. We don't have to hide from him because we don't have to be afraid of him. He's a merciful and a loving God who's not looking to punish us, but to forgive us and give us a fresh start, a new chance to do things his way. So today, friends, I hope this verse is a reminder for you that you don't have to hide from love. You don't have to hide from the one who knows you inside and out, who created you and who loves you no matter what.